Hi, I'm Nick Baker. I'm a naturalist, broadcaster, author, but more importantly, I'm a fan of everything insect. And I'm ambassador for the Pollinator Project in Guernsey. Now, have you heard of the Pollinator Project? Well, we've been around for a little while. We've been organising school visits, hosting talks by pollinator experts. We organised the Paint a Bee competition last year, and we've been developing pollinator patches throughout the island, all aimed at making Guernsey a better place to be no pun intended. And this year we're going to be making it even easier for you to roll your sleeves up and get involved. And remember, it's not just about the bees. We're about creating habitats for all manner of pollinating insects. I've got a question for you. Do you think it's possible for everyone to put aside, say, 10% of their garden for wildlife and, starting with children, give them an appreciation of the vital role that insects and other pollinators have in our health and well-being? Well, I'd like to think so, because actually it's not that difficult. Now, I appreciate we're all in various states of lockdown right now, but I'll tell you something. This garden, this is my garden, it's quite small and some would say quite scruffy, but it has been my salvation over the last couple of weeks. Not just all the flowers coming out, but the life that these flowers attract, and that is what it is all about. Now, I am very much aware that not all of you are lucky enough to have a garden, even a small scruffy one like this, but even a window box, well planted of course, or a bee box put up on a sunny wall can all help make a difference. So, how do you enjoy your pollinators? Well, first of all, you've got to find a nice flowery patch, but it's no good staying up there where most humans are. You've got to get right down to their level stick your head in the flowers, really appreciate what they're getting up to. Get eyeball to compound eye with the pollinators that we're talking about. And don't worry about them either. None of these insects are going to harm you. In fact, they've got much better things to do than bother with us. But watch them go about their business. Look for the dusting of pollen on their bodies. Look to see if the bees are carrying pollen in pollen baskets on their back legs. And while you're doing so, reflect on that win-win relationship between insects flowers and of course us and all the value that this little thing brings to us. Now appreciated pollinators is what this project is all about but if you want to take it another step and get involved with the pollinator project citizen science side of things then there is a marvellous app that is free to download from your app store and it's called Bumbler and it allows you to record the species of bumblebee that you see visiting um, your flowers. It's dead easy, it's free to download. Wait for it to open up, look at that, I like the beginning. <laughs> In comes the Carla bee doing a bit of pollination on a borage flower. But this is the important bit, you can submit your sightings. There's a little field guide so you can actually look at the various bumblebees. You can identify and decide what it is you're looking at. Then you record where you've seen it. And then there's loads of other information about why we're doing it and uh, other resources that you can follow up on as well. It's a great little app. The Pollinator Project Guernsey has made it really, really easy for you to get involved and get the most out of the nature in your garden and in Guernsey's fabulous countryside. Look out for a mailing coming through your letterbox very soon with loads of ideas on how you can get involved. We've got bumblebee identification, all six Guernsey bumblebee species, a designer butterfly competition, look out for that coming soon plus a, a butterfly field guide. Now, of course, there's many, many more resources than I've got time to mention right now, but don't forget the free to download Bumbler app if you want to get involved with the citizen science project and want to work out where Guernsey's bees are and what they're up to. Oh, and one other thing, you can also apply for a free packet of seeds that allows you to set up your own pollinator patch. So that's pretty much it. Get out there and enjoy the nature on your beautiful islands and stay safe. I'll see you soon.